hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel so today we're making this very yummy and delicious meat pie so stay tuned so first we are missing our dough and guys it is very important you always sieve your flour to avoid dirt or lumps so guys the accurate measurement for this recipe will be on the description bar so do well to check next i added my powdered nutmeg and salt and guess what guys this is a no baking powder meat pie recipe and the outcome will wow you trust me so next i added my margarine then do the squeeze in method So guys, this is how your dough should look like when you're done with the squeeze in method. Now I'll be adding my water bits by bits. So this is how your dough should look like when you're done. I'm just gonna leave this to rest and let's go make our meat pie filling. So my oil is heated. I added my oil, onion to saute for about five to seven minutes. Next, I'm adding my beef and I will stir it until it's brown. And you don't want it cuddling, so you have to stir properly. So guys, the spatula I was using was not helping at all, so I had to quickly change it. Guys, please give this video a thumbs up. And if you've not subscribed to this channel, please, subscription is totally free, free of charge. Please and please do well to subscribe. And to my returning subscribers, thank you very much for always tuning in. I'm super super grateful and honored. Thank you. So what I added was ginger and garlic paste. Then stir. And next I added my potato, carrot and black pepper. Guys, you can use any pepper of your choice. You can use the white pepper, the green pepper or even scotch bonnet pepper, okay? So next I added my seasoning powder, salt, curry powder and thyme. Guys, one of the secrets to get that very yummy and delicious meat pie filling is curry powder. Curry powder takes your filling to another level. Trust me. <laughs> so after this process, I added water so my filling can cook well. Guys, I noticed the curry powder was not enough so I had to add more. So as to get that yummy and delicious filling for my meat pie. Oh, 
corn flour thickener. So guys, our meat pie filling is ready. Next, I clean my wok surface thoroughly and then flour. So guys, for the first and second filling, I used a meat pie cutter. So if you don't have a meat pie cutter, there are 101 ways to make a meat pie and it will come out very beautiful. So just calm down, okay? Guys, can you see how beautiful our meat pie is looking already? And without baking powder. Without baking powder, guys. Hmm... So here is the method without a quarter. Guys, I think I prefer this method. Which do you prefer? And finally, I egg wash, then send to the oven to bake for 40 minutes. And finally guys, our delicious and yummy meat pie is ready. Crunchy outside, super moist inside. So thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share. Bye-bye.